the funniest thing that happened in school. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another video. I am joined by an extra special... Tucker! I am joined by an extra special guest. My best friend from childhood all the way up to... Are you kidding me? <laughs> my childhood best friend all the way till now with her annoying ass dog, Tucker. Welcome to the channel, Dana. Thank you. I think we're gonna go so ahead natural. and cut all that. So natural on camera. Long before Mateo, there was Dana, and <laughs> I talk to Dana probably more than I do Mateo on a daily basis. There is very few things that I don't know about her and vice versa. So to put that to the test, we have Susan, picture will be shown here. Um, who's basically my second mother, she will be asking us the questions and we will be newlywed style answering, maybe telling some stories and anecdotes and uh, away we go. Are you ready? Are you excited? Ready. You got makeup all over your nose. Are you kidding me? I can't Thank work you. under these conditions. All right, and first question, let it rip. Where did you meet? This is an easy one. Oh, I already... Don't know how to spell. <laughs> Very good. So we did meet in Sunday school. Sue was our teacher. Um, none of us go to that <laughs> church anymore. <laughs> Promptly left that um, church. But we did meet there. Actually, one of the best stories was you, we were watching Veggie Tales at some youth group group. And Dana I called, called Nick. I called Nick over to the front to sit next to me because there was a seat next to me open. And when he got there, I pulled the seat right out from under him and he fell in front of the entire class. At church, a sinner, a born sinner. How long have you known one another? <laughs> Close. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we met when we were four. That was when Nick asked me out. In 20 BC. <laughs> what is your favorite thing to do together? There are very few things we do because we're pretty lazy. Well, one of us is. <laughs> My marker sucks. They were on discount. What's yours? Binge watch TV. Yeah, that's literally all. I've been in Richmond for five days and I think we've done that. Nick's been horizontal for all five of them. And I don't regret it. Who is the funniest? I think you all know the answer. Absolutely not. No one better, no one greater. <laughs> what was the first job you had together? Together or first job? First job together. together. Well, Nick had no job. That is, I Dana, worked more Dana than Dana worked her. and Nick attended. That's not true. I worked more what, jobs what than What was you the did. name of that, the? Well, together. But first job was. Well, this was, this was, Maybe my job. Yeah, the health club was technically the first job that Dana worked Isn't at. the Blue Ridge Gym is what I wrote? <laughs> Something health club? Yeah, the health club. The I health worked club. and Nick attended. I came and visited. Right. But technically, Every day. where we both were employed was McDonald's, which that was a good time because every time we... <laughs> we would get there and they would send me to the grill <laughs> and Nick to the drive-through. It's like the one place where you're supposed to get, you know, where you, you're supposed to be able to work the counter. I know, I was gonna say, while this no. is sexist, usually at grocery stores, fast food, everything, the girls always work drive-through and the counter and the guys always work the gym. No, no, grill. Dana to the grill, coming Dana. in hot. Dana, we're sending you to the grill. Nick, you're at uh, the register and drive Meanwhile, through. all of the orders that I'm cooking, bagging, and bringing to the front are being eaten <laughs> in the drive through <laughs> by this one. I didn't say I was a good employee. And I then also. Break, break would come along. <laughs> 
And Nick's order, because we got to order lunch, would be two double quarter pounders, a 10 piece nugget, and six sugar cookies. And then he would go home because he would be sick. But I got to go home early. <laughs> and Dana, while she's complaining about the grill, she was back there and at one point her sister Erin, who was one of our managers, she was a I think. Food chainer. Yeah. We would look back and they'd be like chanting, Dane, all these guys are surrounding her as she's like racing some guy to assemble the burger fast enough. The Big Mac so contest. You liked it. I won. Did you last longer there than no. me? Then you? Everyone yeah. did. That's fair. We Two then stars. promptly moved across to the, the hallway to the Exxon where we that also was a good time. both we worked. worked there together. And just like McDonald's, we would show up. <laughs> And they go, Dana to the pumps. Dana, we're gonna have you wash the pumps. The gas pumps. <laughs> and Nick, you're gonna work the register. But the best part is, we would have like coffee and ice the coffee that you're part. supposed to refill. And Dana's out there slinging at the I pumps. Come in, and I'm, I come in, I'm dripping in sweat and gasoline, probably. <laughs> and all the coffee pots are empty. This one's got an iced coffee. There's a line out the door. Every coffee pot's empty, but his is full. And then they <laughs> refill the coffee. <laughs> oh, that's some good times. Most liked in high school? Me. <laughs> write it down. <laughs> What'd you write? Yeah. She was. I wasn't. Someone asked me, I wasn't particularly mean to people, but I wasn't super friendly. Everyone liked you for some reason. I don't know why, because you were mean to everybody. No, I wasn't. I was a delight. Next. Your favorite class. Mm. I'm Chorus. working late. Oh, yearbook. Because I'm a singer. We were both yearbook editors. <laughs> It's not even a class. Which was it a basically class? meant that the entire yearbook was pictures of us. We were yearbook editors. First of all, we graduated with 90 kids, so we're talking small. And we did an entire dedication <laughs> page to, to <us>. ourselves. <laughs> People bought these. And it's a page. 65 bucks a pop for pictures of Nick and Dana the funniest thing that happened in school. So okay. ask the question again. <laughs> What's the funniest I'm thing? I'm sorry, we're finding a new question, reader. What's the funniest thing that happened to you in school? <laughs> <laughs> Shit was airborne. <laughs> First of all, you have to give Context. Okay, well, the context is... We, I was in health class. Actually, this is partly the funniest thing that happened to you as well. Yeah. So it's e a, it's I a mean, joint easily, story. yes. So I was in health class, and we were watching a drunk driving video, and I get very queasy and very sort of lightheaded easily, oh, as you all know. So I passed out, and my emergency... During the drunk driving scene... Right, they were like drilling into the head. So I pass out and my cousin happened to be in the class. So they got a wheelchair and my cousin Josh was wheeling me to the nurse's office. Unbeknownst to me, cause I was out of it, they called my emergency contact who was my 16 year old <laughs> friend across the hall in math I don't class. even know that I was your emergency contact. I think they just called me because we did everything together, maybe. I'm across the hall in math class, and the teacher's like, Dana, the phone's for you. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm 16, I'm sitting in math class. It's the nurse. Dana, Nick's on his way here. He passed out during health class. We're gonna need you to come care for him and make sure he gets home okay. So I leave class, my education, wonder why I never passed any AP classes. Well, that's- I leave class right. and I, I get to the cafeteria and across the cafeteria, Nick is being wheeled off and fanned and fanned. That's what they had to do. So I get to the nurse's office and he's, a con the fan continues. They have my socks off, they're rubbing my feet. I ha we had to leave school, I had to drive him home. So they let her leave early to drive me home. <laughs> but I had volleyball practice that night and mm -hmm. I had this coach who was a horrible woman, can't stand her, can't stand the family. 
I hope she does watch. If you're watching, can't stand you. Anyways, she, Dana, goes, because she has to go get my stuff. Yeah, she so goes in after and she I sees drop my you coach, off. And yeah. she sees my coach and she's like, you should know Nick's not gonna be at practice. And this idiot goes. Did he catch epilepsy? <laughs> it's going around. Did he catch epilepsy? It's going around. Now I know you all think I'm stupid, but that's stupid. That was the most embarrassing for both of us. Yeah, I think so. But it did get me out of school a half a day, so I True. take take what comes. Who's a better driver? Me. Me. I'm not right about me. Just me. How many tickets have you gotten? None. <laughs> <laughs> I remember leaving our house for school in the morning, my house. Well, Aaron. E all three of us, all three of us had different, we all drove separate cars, even though we were going to the same place. <laughs> <laughs> and we would be going racing, actually. I think it was a NASCAR race to get to school between the three of us, to which Aaron always won. Yeah, because she's a maniac. I can't hear this. Yeah. Now that oh, happens great. too. Who cut more school? Honestly, it's a Both. tie. We, yeah. um, I gotta be honest, any of the teachers watching, Deb Slater, I know you're watching, <laughs> shout out Deb. Um, we pretty much barely went our senior year, even our junior mm -hmm. year when Aaron was a senior, because at that point, I learned my dad's signature in eighth grade and you and Aaron would mm -hmm. always call your mom with some reason that she had to call you out and she's too trusting that she would believe you all. Mm. And, one by one, we would just fake these notes there was, and get out of school. There was one day, there was one day, it, I I can't remember if I got out first or Aaron. I can't remember which one of us signed our way out, but I I remember getting down there to sign myself out for whatever non-appointment non that I had, and you had already signed yourself out. So Aaron was first. It was um, like literally second period. We had just gotten to school, <laughs> and Aaron, mm -hmm. Signed herself out. We made had it. Sue we made it through study hall. Or something, <laughs> and she left. But we didn't know she had left. Then I decided I didn't want to be there anymore. I wrote a note as my dad saying I needed to leave for some appointment. So mm -hmm. I left, didn't realizing Aaron. And literally, like ten minutes later, Dana didn't realize Aaron and I had left, and she had went and signed out. Yeah. And one by one, I remember driving into my driveway and Aaron's car is there. And I was like, why is Aaron's car there? And then yes. as I'm pulling in, Dana's pulling in <laughs> behind me. And we're all like... I guess we're going to watch Friends today. Guess we're sitting on the couch and eating pastina. <laughs> Boxes. R.I.P. Pastina. They don't make that anymore. It's so sad. Do you even Our know this piece cars. of shit? This piece of shit would take two minutes to get ready and then lay flat watching <laughs> Safe by the Bell until the well, minute what am we I leave. Supposed to do? All of our cars need to be defrosted. Do you think he could turn on one freaking car? And of no. course, we didn't wait for them to defrost. No. We're driving with ice. <laughs> <laughs> Literally speeding. Really safe. What's your favorite holiday? Who's mine you or Nick's? You say mine and I say yours. Yeah. Um, what well, we've literally game? been doing this entire time. What part of this game? She's not good at, who's the no. worst at games? <laughs> we play games every yeah. holiday. Yeah. Who has the worst and grammar? She can never, well, I didn't say I had good grammar. Language, can't speak write English. Write it down, write it down. <laughs> <laughs> definitely, yes, definitely like Thanksgiving. I made? That was very artistic. You do. You love Thanksgiving. And your whole family. Yes, it's like Thanksgiving your big is. Holiday. Yes, that is our big holiday. And I normally spend a lot of Thanksgivings with you. Yes. Um, my birthday's not my favorite. Christmas is. I know. I love Christmas. Well, puppy, we made it's been it. Fun. Thank you for filming. You can now get off my back about filming a video with you. I'm so happy to participate. Uh, do you want to say anything to your throng? For the, new yes, for the record, everything that Nick has said about me prior to this video is inaccurate. One hundred percent true. It's absolutely inaccurate. It's a lie. It's not even. It's like it's like I didn't spend four hundred years of my life with this one. Thank you for watching. Do you want to do the outro? Do you know what to say? No. Please like, comment, subscribe. Oh, please like, comment, and subscribe to my friends. Very exciting channels, YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, I'm TikTok, on. 
Didn't even know that. I'm Twitter. not even on t t Twitter. Until next time. We got to do this. Ready?